So you have a Moto G power phone, you have an issue where you have a black screen here. Even though you have a black screen, you know that the phone is on. Maybe you may get some phone calls in or hear some notifications or feel it vibrate or see some LED lights. Anyway, I'm going to give you guys several solutions to get you up and running right now. First thing to note that this phone is actually fixed, but let's just pretend I have a black screen here. Okay, so first thing is this. What we want to do is force it to restart. Simply just press and hold this power button and don't let go until you see the Motorola's logo pop up. So we'll do it together. Power button here. Let's press and hold. One, two, three. Press and hold. Do not let go. Pretend my phone is totally black. I have no idea what's going on. I'm just holding on to this power button. This typically takes maybe like 15 seconds. So I'm still holding on to the power button. Still holding, just waiting for a Motorola logo to appear right there. Go ahead and let go and hopefully you are back up and running. Now if you're not, we're going to go to the next possible solution. Okay, so if the first step didn't work for you, we're going to go to the second step here. So second step is first thing is this, where the power button is here, what I want you to do is this. I want you to press the power button in and out. Just go crazy like this because it's possible it's stuck or jammed and whatnot and it can cause the black screen. So just keep pressing it like that, get it all nice and loose. Now let's go ahead and plug it in. We're going to give it some power, okay? So go ahead and just plug it in, just like this. And now while it's plugged in, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to press and hold this power button. Ready? One, two, three. Press and hold. Pretend my screen is totally black. I have no idea what's going on. I'm just holding on to this power button, just waiting for a Motorola logo to appear. Still holding. Still holding this power button. There it is. Go ahead and let go. And hopefully, you are now out of the black screen. If you still have a black screen, we're going to go to the next step. Okay, so for this next step, you can go ahead and unplug it. And again, let's pretend my screen is totally black. What we're going to do here is what I call the tap method. What we're going to do is we're going to hold the phone like this, and we're going to use two fingers. And what we're going to do is we're going to tap all over the front and the back of the phone. Okay, so we'll start off with the screen here. Again, just pretend my phone is totally black. Let's start tapping two fingers here. Now, what happens is, um, you know, sometimes if you drop your phone or whatnot, it'll get something in the back will get slightly dislodged. And sometimes as you're tapping like this, going all crazy, ooh, make sure you don't hear any of that. Sometimes the screen will pop on, sometimes you'll start getting lines, like it wants to like um, get the display back on. So just keep tapping like that and on the back. Same thing, okay? You wanna go ahead and press kind of hard, even near the fingerprint sensor, all around the lens as well. Just get all in there, turn it over, see if the black screen is still there, but it's still there. Then from here, do the same thing. Press and hold that power button. Do not let go until the Motorola logo appears. Then go ahead and let go. Hopefully now you're out of the black screen. If you're still in here, then the next thing we're going to do is, is what I call the massage method. What we're going to do is we're going to use two thumbs. We're going to hold it like this, and we're going to massage the front of the screen and the back of the screen. Okay, You can get like a cloth or something like that or paper towel if you don't want to smudge up your, um, your screen or whatnot. But anyway, what we're going to do is just grab the phone like this, and what I'm doing is pressing in both thumbs like this press in. sometimes you hear like a little snap or sometimes when you're doing this all of a sudden it'll start flashing or the screen will just come right on okay so just keep doing this keep massaging it all over kind of hard all the way down the very bottom all over okay and the same thing on the back you want to go ahead and you just want to press press all over even around the fingerprint sensor all around the lens here too you want to go ahead and just press press sometimes you hear like a little snap and then if you hear a snap, turn it over and it may be back on, okay? Anyway, once you give that like a nice massage, if it's still a black screen, then do the same thing. Press and hold that power button. Do not let go until you see the Motorola logo appear. Then go ahead and let go and hopefully you're up and running. Now, if you're still down, the next thing I have for you is what I call the smack method, okay? Go ahead and put your palm out like this and you want to smack the, uh, the screen as well as the back of the phone, okay? Just remember, I'm not responsible for anything that happens to your phone, okay? So do everything at your own risk. Okay, so palm out. What I want to do is smack it like that. And you're smacking it. See if anything is happening to the screen too, okay? Also on the bottom of the back. You know, see if anything is popping up on the screen, any flashes or anything. And now, same thing with the screen side. Give it a couple of whacks. Kind of look at it. A couple of whacks there. Look at it. And then the same thing on the uh, bottom side. Go ahead and give it a whack. Kind of look at it. See if anything is turning on. If it's still black from here, do the same thing. Press and hold that power button. Do not let go until you see the Motorola logo appear. Then go ahead and let go. Okay, so here's the thing. Now, if you went all the way this far and it didn't work for you, what I want you to do before I do the last step here, which is the factory reset, what I want you to do is try every single step in the beginning of the video. Try it three, four, 
five, six more times. If you've done all these steps again at six, the sixth time and it's still down, then we can go ahead and try to do a factory reset. Okay, and how you're gonna do that, we're gonna use the hard keys here. So let's just pretend uh, my screen is totally black here. What I'm gonna do is hold the volume down and power button. I'm gonna press and hold button, both buttons at the same time. I'm not gonna let go until I see a dead Android guy on the phone. It usually takes about 15 seconds. So we're gonna do this together, okay? Volume down, power, ready? One, two, three. Press and hold both buttons, do not let go. Volume down, power is held. Still holding, pretend my screen is black here. I have no idea what's going on. I'm just hoping for some kind of dead Android guy to appear. Still holding, still holding. Okay, now hopefully you're able to see the screen where you get a dead Android guy, okay? If you're here, then we can go ahead and proceed. So what you wanna do from here is you wanna use the volume rockers and you just wanna go ahead and go to where it says recovery mode right here and then select it. Go ahead and tap on the power button right there and then uh, give it one second. Then we should see like a no command down here with a dead Android guy. Okay, it says no command here, dead Android guy. So from here, what you want to do is you want to press and hold the power button, hold the power button, and then tap the volume up button once, okay? So I'm going to press and hold the power button and the, and the volume up button. I'm just going to tap it once, and there you go, okay? So from here, what you want to do is go down to white data slash factory reset. Don't forget, guys, with a factory reset, you're going to lose everything on the phone. It's going to be as if you bought the phone brand new and took it out of the box, and you got to start off with the setup, you know, choose your language, uh, enter your Wi-Fi information and whatnot. So use the, vo uh, the uh, volume rockers up and down to scroll up or down, scroll up or down. So we're going to go down to white data slash factory reset. And then if you want to continue or proceed, go ahead and tap on the power button here. And then this basically gives you a warning. This cannot be undone. You will erase everything. So if you want to proceed, use the volume rockers, go down one to factory reset, and then go ahead and tap that power button and let it do its thing. It typically takes about three minutes or so. Okay. Anyway, this is the last thing that you want to try to do is erase everything off your phone. If any of these steps work for you, uh, let me know which step and give me a thumbs up. If it didn't work for you, uh, go ahead and give me a uh, thumbs down. All these methods here, it's a, you have like a 50-50 shot, okay? Good luck, guys.